height of the pandemic, a Portsmouth business was facing shutting down until the owner turned to a local and she decided to take the reins. In today's Friday Flavor, come with me to the coffee shop as I talk to the new owner, Tiffany Linton. Her words, you know, God told her that this shop was for us. At the height of the pandemic, Tiffany and Lamar Linton took over the coffee shop in Portsmouth. You come in here and you don't look at the small lobby or the old furniture or the brick walls. You don't see that. You you see the heart that's here. Kindness and love radiate through this place. We, we call ourselves like the small cheers of Old Town. A homey spot where everybody knows your name. For Tiffany, home is a big deal. I'm able to give back to where I grew up, you know? It's like I remember being down here when I was young. A Portsmouth native serving good food in her hometown. Breakfast burritos, New York bagels, and some other classics. Lamar, Tiffany's husband, is from Louisiana. It's Cajun Jamalai that we make in-house and the Old Fashioned Club. I'm more of an old smoky guy. Uh, smoking for 20 hours is a pulled pork sandwich here. Uh, it's named after my mom. Uh, so her nickname is Smokey. The coffee is good too, with barista or comedian Alan Hudson knowing how it's done. Uh, we don't concentrate our uh, cold brew. Our cold brew is made in-house. Or get a specialty brew. One of our biggest things is a trust me latte. So you just gotta trust us on it and then you'll fall in love. They offer funny specials each month too. If you're in a rush, they're speedy. But I suggest pulling up a chair and staying a while. I want you to come in, I want to know who you are. You're not, you're not just a number to us, you're not a monetary note to us, you're family to us. I can confirm, at the coffee shop, it truly feels like home. That's our goal is we just want everyone to feel like family when you walk in the door. And we want you to leave even happier. It's just the best place. They were so kind and so warm as soon as we walked in. And here's an insider detail for you. They told me there is a big surprise coming this June. So I'll bring you the details when they announced that surprise. They were very excited about it. You know it's going to be a good one. Hey, of course, I'm always looking for a new spot to check out. If you have one in mind, shoot me an email or get my attention on Facebook or Twitter. You know, I will say they're cold brew. One of the best I have ever had. Ooh. So.